Kate, welcome to Bolton Wanderers. How does it feel to have made the move? Um, yeah, thank you very much. It's been good. Um, it's quite a quick process, to be fair. Um, I've been wanting to get out for a while and play football. Obviously, um, Sheffield United are doing very well, and um, the players there are doing fantastic. So. It was very hard for me to get um, a chance, but um, I'm here now and I'm excited to get some games under my belt. You're from Greater Manchester. I'm sure then this is a club that you know all about with it being on your doorstep, really. Yeah, I've watched Bolton from the days when it was in the Premier League and obviously it's a shame what's happened over recent years, but hopefully now the time has changed where we can turn the corner and kind of get the club going back in the right direction. You've been at Sheffield United for about a year and a half and for whatever reason you've not played a great deal of football. I'm guessing then the, the aim is for you to come here and play regularly. Yeah, of course. Yeah, I've got I've come to to play regularly. Nowhere you, you guarantee you're not guaranteed to play anywhere you go. You have to work to get your place in the team. Um, but yeah, Sheffield United was a frustrating time. Um, the first se the first season was kind of injuries, and then like, this year we had a good pre season, and um, I was told that I was wanted to stay, which was good for me. Um, however, always things in football change quickly. Um, they got off to a great start, and from then I kind of just didn't get a chance to. To, to, to play, so um, I'm grateful for the opportunity here. Still only 23 years old, it's an important time in your career and it's a time where you, you need to be playing regularly really, isn't it? Yeah, definitely, yeah. Um, last time I played um, league football, or regular football should I say, was over a year ago now, so definitely yeah, I need to get playing week in, week out again. Does the fact that appearances have been limited in the last sort of year or two, does that make you more eager to get back out onto the grass and playing football again? Yeah, definitely, because I feel like, again, I have to prove how good I can be again because it's been a while since um, I was in form um, so hopefully I can show what I can do here. And you've had loan spells with Bury and Oldham in this league, it's a league that you know well isn't it? Yeah I know it well, um, I've played games in this league, um, I'd hope to say that I did well when I played in this league so hopefully I can kind of hit the ground running when, when I get back my chance to play. David Flitcroft, the assistant manager, you work with him at Bury. Are you looking forward to working with him again and, and obviously getting to know Keith Hill as well? Yeah, definitely. Um, obviously I worked with Flickers at Bury, he, that was my first loan so he kind of took me in and looked after me when I was there. Um, I played games, I enjoyed it um, and Obviously, meeting the new manager today, it's exciting. Um, he's full of energy, as everyone knows. Um, it was a good first training session. Um, everyone was bright and at it, so hope, looking forward to Saturday. We know you're a defender, and we know also that early in your career you played a bit in midfield as well. What can you yeah. tell us about what sort of a player you are? Um, well, yeah, yeah, now I'd say I'm a left-sided centre-half. Um, however, I have played in the holding midfield position. Um, quite a versatile player. Um, but I'd like to see myself playing in that left side centre half position. I feel comfortable there and I feel like I can prove to people that I'm, I'm a good player there. The next game, Tranmere Rovers on Saturday. I'm guessing that's a game that you're, you're very much looking forward to being involved in if you're selected. Yeah, definitely. If I'm selected, obviously that's the manager's choice. But um, I've come here to play a game, so hopefully I'm, I'm playing. And if I am, then I'm ready to show what I can do. It's a real challenge for the club in, in what has in truth been a really tough season. Is it a challenge that excites you? Yeah, definitely, because it, the situation is what it is. I knew the situation before I signed. However, for me, I need to play football. I need to get that hunger back. So for me, I need to come here and fight. And hopefully, you know, football is a crazy game. Crazy things have happened. So let's just give it our all and we can all do our best. The manager has said in the past that it, it takes a special type of character to want to come to Bolton, considering the, the situation we're in at the moment. Would you say that you tick that box? Yeah, well, definitely. Um, it's a mass. Bolton's a massive club. It's not. It's not a little club. Um, everyone knows who Bolton Football Club, um, and I'm just excited to be here. To be honest, and like I said, the thing is for me, I need to get back playing football regularly. So hopefully, I can do that here. When you're a player joining a club who's in the situation that we're in, in the midst of a, a real relegation battle, have you got to be optimistic and positive at the same time? Well, yeah, otherwise you, you bet you might as well say you're already down and, and dusted or say you in League 2. It's, that's not the case. You kind of have to fight while we're in this league. Every game that we have, there's still a lot of games to play. There's like some games in hand and all. So if we win them, um, I just think it's just getting everything right on the pitch, getting a real togetherness within the squad and hopefully we can go, go at it now from January and, and see, what, see what comes at the end of the season.